Uh, are you <laughs> pro or con page builders like Elementor? Um, well, they they have their uses, uh, and I. <laughs> Um, Should we leave it at that? I I I want to like them. Sometimes they make it a bit hard. Um, Elementor are good friends, um, but um, I I think there's a there's a lot to be said for how Elementor allows people to build websites, and I I think that's uh, that's good. And it comes with a bit of a performance penalty in, in, in both in terms of speed as in, in terms of SEO, which they seem to be trying to mitigate, which is also good. Um, I have a lot of trust in that team, but honestly, I would prefer if everyone just built on Gutenberg and on full site editing, which is coming to core uh, over, over the future. I think that's yeah. better. Um, I think a lot of these page builders were built because full site editing and core basically came too late. Um, but as we have full site editing and core soon, as soon as we have that, I would hope that everybody would slowly transfer to that because honestly, as a plugin developer, having 25, 30, 35 different big page builder plugins out there is horrible. Yeah, they all have their own different approaches and they all come with a, some trade-off of flexibility for performance. And they make different technical decisions and different architectural decisions. It's, it's a pain. 